This model is going to illustrate rheoscopic motion, i.e. The, the motion within fluids, such that you can see the eddy currents and other motion. Um, to do this, the acrylic sphere is filled with water and silver mica. Now these are very small, so they will be suspended in the liquid and we want to produce a rotating effect. Now inside the globe there is a small neodymium magnet, a ball magnet, with two other magnets on the side and this is going to act as an impeller. In other words, we're going to get this to spin within that globe. So to do this, there's a motor mounted underneath the surface and it rotates quite fast and the, the idea is that it, the ball magnet will synchronise its rotation rate with the magnet underneath. And we should see that in the next video. Now we're going to see the ball being powered up and the motor kicks off and sure enough the ball magnet is synchronised with it and we now see the mica particles flowing up into the globe. And as they do they will start to adopt a rotation. And as it comes up to speed you can see that the mica is illustrating the currents within the globe traced out by the mica particles which uh, gives a pretty stunning effect. Lastly, we're going to replace the silver globe with a globe full of blue mica. And once again, we're going to power up the motor. And that will couple with the magnet that's inside the globe. And sure enough, here it is kicking up the blue mica. And because it's a dark blue color, the, the mica is tracing in, in a lighter blue. So there's quite a good contrast. And it's, it's very effective. I can alter the lighting slightly. And so that will continuously rotate and has no moving parts inside other than this ball magnet that's been powered from below.